What's going on guys? My name is Clay and in today's video we're going to be checking out my best Haymaker class setup in Modern Warfare 3. If you're new to my channel make sure to hit that subscribe button and also like the video. Let's try to get this video to 50 likes. I'd highly appreciate it and it helps out the channel a bunch. So over on my secondary I am using the WSP Stinger. I do not have any attachments on it right now because I haven't really looked at it too much and I don't really pull out my secondary that much. On the tactical I'm using the stem just to get it away from like tight scenarios if i'm weak the frag grenade i am using on my lethal and i am using demolition vest so i can get two of those and i am basically having on resupply over on the field upgrade i am using the trophy system the gloves i'm using scavenger just so i could pick up ammo while i'm on the go and the boots is the lightweight boots to give you extra movement i have been thinking about changing this to covert sneakers maybe something else i'm just not too sure yet over on the gear, I'm using the attack mask. I personally like using EOD because I don't like getting naded a lot, but it doesn't work in this game right now. And I'm not sure if they're going to change it, but that's what I'm using right now. So jumping over into the class setup over on the stock, I'm using the Ironhide Brace Stock for gun kick control, firing aim stability, movement speed, and sprint speed. This gun has a lot of recoil and using this helps a little bit, but it's still going to have recoil regardless. Over on the magazine, I am using the 12 round mag. At first, I didn't have a magazine in the beginning of the game because I didn't level a gun all the way up. But as I leveled it up, I'm definitely using the 12 round mag. The 20 round mag, maybe, but I like 12 rounds. It's it's perfect. And over on the underbarrel, I'm using the XRK Edge BW4 handstop just to overall boost my movement. I like running around and getting in people's faces with a shotgun, so this helps out a lot. You add aim walking speed, movement speed, aim down sight speed, and sprint to fire speed. Over on the barrel, I'm using the Imperator long barrel for bullet velocity and range. This gun struggles a lot whenever it comes to killing people at like, even you can see on the minimum damage range, it is less than 30 meters. It's really, really bad. And I wish you could make this gun stronger. There isn't like, no ammunition that i would use because you lose damage range and if you don't lose damage range i'm well no all of them take away damage range and i just don't i don't see a point in using that over on the laser i'm using the canted vibro dot seven laser this is just because i do not like the iron sights and this gun kicks a lot so using this helps a lot but you do like the enemies can see that your laser so that is probably the downside they know when you're coming but you do add a lot of sprint to fire speed and aiming stability as well as aim down sight speed so that is really good that's going to do it for this class setup this is the best thing i could come up with if you guys have a better class setup for me to use let me know what that is down in the comments please i have a crazy gameplay for you guys it was really really hectic if you enjoyed that let me know with a like and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace A small percentage of people that watch my videos are subscribed, so if you like this video, consider subscribing, and also follow me on Twitch where I stream and play with followers. Also, if you'd like to, you can follow me on Twitter where you can stay up to date with me. And I also have a Discord, so if you'd like to, we can connect more on there. Now let's get back to the video. Alright, we're going to be using the Haymaker. For some reason, I always end up getting this map with this gun. But... <clears throat> We have a pretty decent class. I mean, I think this, the shotguns in this game are not as good as MW2 was. So it's kind of hard to, um, to get a good video with this gun. I've been trying, actually just woke up and I'm going to try again. Cause I don't want to give you all like a 40 kill gameplay. I'm going to try to get a 50. He may seem to get on the hill though. It's just hard. It's really, really hard to get on the hill. I think I know what I need to do. I don't have trophies. Okay. 
I need to unlock that. Dang, everybody's just ready for me. Teammates are running away from the hill. And not let that happen to you. Come on, team. What are we doing? I have to use my, my secondary there, like. All right, let's try to get on this one. This one's going to be even harder for a shotgun player. Now that I unlocked the 12 round mag, then this is going to be so much easier. At least as far as like getting multiple kills. On, I can't be the only one trying to jump on the hill. Whatever. Let's go over here. Hmm, there's something you could do to, to an RPG. I didn't even see him. Where they just spawned back there? They always have trophies ready for them. So hard to get things going with this shotgun. Come on, teammates, that's like the whole team.
Here we go. We're getting something going. I forgot where next hill is. Oh, it's back there. They're all spawning right there. We have 50 kills right now. Oh my god. This is a really good game for this gun. You usually can't do this. I just, I hate this map with, with this shotgun. I hate this map. But any other like gun, I'll, I'll play this map. I just can't get anything else with this gun for some reason. And I really need a trophy system too. Oh wait, I have one. I thought I didn't have one this entire time. We're spawning all the way over here. This is not good. What? He's in the corner, weirdo. I had to run in there just to contest. Hey teammate. He just runs through everybody and looks right at me. I shoot my teammates first, bro. Teammates, stay on there. Did 
Let's go. 66 kills. GG's.